Tomorrow, Dallas ISD students will be returning to Wilmer Hutchins High School alongside plenty of additional counselors and police officers. This is all coming after a shooting Friday that left one teen injured and another in police custody. Parents want to know exactly how this weapon made it onto campus in the first place, despite metal detectors, cameras, and a clear backpack policy. District and law enforcement officials are investigating that. And then in the meantime, Dallas ISD trustee Maxie Johnson says this is just part of a really more concerning problem that's affecting families everywhere, even his own. It's very sensitive and very serious uh, uh, matter to me because I'm a victim of uh, senseless gun violence. My son was killed due to, due to gun violence. And so we want to make sure that our children are uh, not uh, getting, in the, getting into trouble or our children don't have guns. It is very important that we do something about it and make sure that guns are not in the hands of our children. Johnson is now inviting concerned community members to a town hall meeting this week to try to address those gun violence issues among youth. It's set at 7 p.m. Tuesday night at the new Morningstar Missionary Baptist Church along Denison Street in West Dallas.